This is a video on how to make a checkerboard with a chop saw, a CNC mill, and a laser engraver. We bought some poplar and some oak strips from Home Depot. And you set up a jig to make sure they're all the same size and cut them on the chop saw. The poplar is one color and the oak is the other. To make the checkers, we're gonna use a program called Easel and get it all set up on the milling machine. You can see as it mills, it leaves little tick marks so the checker stays in the piece of wood. We're using the same wood that we used for the checkerboard for the checkers to make sure they match. Once this checker is milled out, it'll start on the next checker and so on and so on. It seems like once you learn how to use the milling machine, you end up using it for just about everything. Half the checkers you mill out of poplar and the other half you mill out of oak. Then you just take a chisel and you snap them out, sand them up a little bit, and it almost looks like you're ready to play checkers. We drew the initial design in Inkscape just to make sure it was gonna work. We're gonna take this K40 laser cutter and we're gonna engrave in some of the details that are gonna make this checkerboard really cool. We drew the graphics up in Inkscape and then engraved them right onto the checker. You can see this detail gives the whole set a touch of class. So I hope you enjoyed the process on how to transform these materials into a really fun checkerboard set.